Stand by for the start. Now Revelator has reared up awkwardly, forcing the jockey to dismount. Now the rider back in the saddle. Revelator seemed to have calmed down. Pale rears up, and they're away and uh, racing for the Hyderabad Race Club trophy, slowing to the stride, nothing to worry along with Abala. And as the field settles down, they pass the six and a half furlong pole. It's Wild Spell is the leader from Sound of Cannons on the outside. Memorizer toward the inside railing. Length and a half behind is Rising Sun being tracked there by Peo in the orange and black, making headway on the outside. Another two and a half length behind is Extraordinary. Been overtaken on the outside there by Caracas. Another two and a quarter length away. Coog Regiment with Extraordinary in the center. Evaldo toward the inside railing. Length and a quarter behind is Abela. Then we got Sadik on the outside. They pass the 800 wide of the track there is uh, Revelator after that is nothing to worry with three and a half along in balance Coach Jester is now making a forward move. They're running down towards the entrance of the home stretch as they negotiate the turn now with a little over a quarter of a mile in balance. Wild Spell comes in on first from Sound of Cannon in second. Memorizer is in third. After that is Peo, but it's Wild Spell still about a length and a half in print of a Sound of Cannon. Memorizer is on the outside. After that is Peo. Then we got Evaldo is the one coming up with a dazzling run on the center of the track, but it's going to be Evaldo on the stand. Side from a sound of cannon and memorizer, Peo, Caracas, extraordinary. They all seem to be going nowhere. Prasanna Kumar trained Evaldo winning it from Caracas, Peo, extraordinary wild spell, sound of cannon, memorizer, rising sun, Abela.